So when we're using semicolons, this is one of the models we can use. It's called the some others model. So here I've written some lizards have protruding horns on their heads. Others have sharp spines on their back. It's important to make sure that the clauses on both sides of the semicolon are closely related. So in both of these, I'm talking about a certain aspect of the appearance of lizards. And I'm saying that some have one thing and others have something different. Another model we can use if we're confident with the some others model is to use semicolons to replace coordinating conjunctions like and or but. So if this in this one, I've replaced but with a semicolon. I've written their spines are harmless to humans. They help them stay safe from predators. So here, both of my clauses are closely related. They're both about the spines of lizards. And I've made sure that in both of those clauses, there's a subject and a verb.